What's up everybody welcome to another video a honest review video and I know my subscribers and regular viewers may feel a bit confused why am I doing this video because I usually don't do this type of videos actually this one is my new studio and this one is a bit bigger one than the older one and it's winter now you may have seen in my other video that it's snowing it's heavily snowing and the heating system in this studio is not very good so I have bought some space heaters room heaters I have purchased three room heaters none of those actually made me happy so I have done some research and then bought a new one yeah this one is a bit expensive than the other three that I have bought but this one made me happy so I thought that why don't I share my experience with you so you don't have to go through that painful process of purchasing different space heaters and then returning it and then again purchasing a new one okay finally I have met Drio and I'm pretty happy this one is a 50 US dollars space heater this is a compact but a very powerful space heater okay disclaimer no Drio didn't provide me with this uh, product but I wish if they're watching I mean hey Drio if you are watching this video then would you please provide me a bigger one anyway I'm just sharing my true experience with you if you find this video helpful then please don't forget to click on the like button and if you love this video if you want to watch more videos like this then please don't forget to subscribe and share the love okay this one is the first space heater that i have bought and this was recommended to me by a friend and after i have started to use this space heater i felt so bad it has a thermostat but that's a manual thermostat and if you really want to feel the heat then you need to be in the vicinity of the space heater the front grill or vent sometimes gets very hot and attracts dust and talking about dust at the back it's like wide open the fan intake brings dust easily into the heater because there is no type of filter added and that overall outlook made me to buy a better one a bigger one from the same brand even if these two shares a lot and there are more similarities than differences i thought bigger means better and actually i went for this bigger one because it has oscillation long story short the oscillation is pretty limited and again you have to stay close to feel the heat moreover none of these have tilting protection so if accidentally gets dropped or it's tipped over then it would be a risky thing also at the back this bigger one has a bigger cutout for air intake which only helps to get more dust to get into the heater in the meantime my girlfriend bought another space heater online she thought a different brand would provide the satisfaction that we are looking for okay we both were equally unhappy the design language and performance made us feel like all of these three space heaters are oem products and maybe these are actually coming from the same place we wanted something futuristic within 50 bucks and finally we have met drio within 50 bucks i think this one is the perfect solution to our problem it looks so cool it has a sleek outlook and it has this gray color accent which perfectly got matched to our studio environment when nancy noticed the digital touch buttons on top she was already having high hopes she was pretty happy it has a mode button which will cycle through high low and eco fan speed in eco actually it observes room ambient temperature and changes speed there is a digital thermostat and you can select from 41 to 95 degree fahrenheit actually this one starts to generate heat very quickly and we have never used it beyond 66 degree fahrenheit because the heat actually flows far and you don't have to stay in the vicinity of this product to feel the heat okay this one also has oscillation function and you know what it can rotate up to 70 degree let me show you check carefully can you see the loop wow that's really cool most importantly we don't have to stay close to it as i've mentioned earlier the heat goes far and both me and nancy working in the different corners of the studio can feel the heat finally a space heater has managed to keep us warm oh i think i forgot to mention there is a timer button you can select from 1 to 12 hours you can preset your power of timer depending on your requirement it will automatically turn off okay wait the most important thing is this one has a few necessary protections that you wouldn't easily find in other space heaters this one has tip over protection 
you can see it is showing error code and once tipped over it instantly stops generating heat. Moreover, it blows the heat from the heater, makes it cool and shuts off. Similarly, once you click on the power button to turn it off, it instantly stops generating heat but the blower goes for 30 seconds, makes this unit cold and then shuts off. I did not intend to do a review on this product but this little guy really brought enough satisfaction. So I thought I should share this with my subscribers and viewers. I'm sure it will be very difficult for anybody to find a better space heater within this price range. Oh yeah, one more thing, this one got a mesh filter at the back, so it even protects from dust. Well, that's my true experience, I wish you find this helpful and if you have any question or any recommendation, do not forget to make a comment.